from the chill. It seems like Panda plays Lucina. And Aloha decided to go with the Pichu. Pichu, a very strong character, very awkward hitboxes, along with that forward tilt that everybody has come to know and love and or hate, depending on what end you're receiving. Now we're going to be getting right into it. Panda running with the Lucina. As you saw Marth a little bit earlier, Martha's wonky hitboxes, but Lucina a little bit more consistent in terms of damage and in terms of hitboxes. Double Dancing Blaze not really going to do it. Didn't space it out properly. There's a couple of up tilts to up airs. Trying to end it with the down air. This the down air just baiting out some sort of option and getting it with the forward tilt. Forward smash not going to do it just yet. But I think that forward smash actually might have killed it this percent. Pichu, extremely, extremely powerful. There's the back throw. A couple of Thunder Jolts to force out a, a high recovery. Ooh, okay. Not sure what that was all about. Trying to get Thunder Jolt into the dash attack. Not really going to do it. Oh, following the DI and the up throw, but unable to actually complete it. Forward smash there. Getting a little bit antsy. There's the down smash as a punish. A 77%, definitely within kill percent. Just one well spaced back air and or forward smash but here comes the loops up till up air back air but upper is not really going to do it there's the back throw going to force him to recover low great tech there panda actually able to recover another forward smash not going to do it forward smash has very little end lag coming out from Pichu there's the forward tilt out of the quick attack so fast Oh, 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 mixed them up a little bit. Oh my goodness, he's going to hold shield. There's the back air. Oh, back air trying to call out the high recovery. Not really going to get it just yet. The down air into the forward tilt, but the forward smash actually is going to take it. But will it be a little bit too little too late, especially when you're at 148% against Pichu? One forward tilt can take it. One back air could potentially take it. And we all know what these smash attacks in future can are capable of. <clears throat> Excuse me. Come on there, forward tilt. Going to push him off the stage. 66% with 164% worth of rage. It's actually possible. But I would tack on a little bit more percent. There's the up throw. Thunder able to actually tech the landing. But the dash attack. Trying to get a little bit too antsy there with the down smash. Got a little bit lost there in the scramble. Another forward smash. Going to get punished. Another couple of jabs there. Panda definitely panicking just a little bit. Dash attack to up air. Up air to down air. Trying to call out the landing there, but unable to do so. Thunder covering up high. And able to actually take care of it down low with the back air. And then calling out another low recovery with the down air. Perfect setup. Aloha, taking it to stop here in game number one. All right, it's time to go to Kalos. All right, so now getting right into it, Aloha. With the 1-0 lead, trying to go to Kalos. I've, I'm, I'm a little bit iffy on this choice here. Aloha definitely has a lot more room to just combo, especially when he was comboing off the ground with Panda throwing out a lot of panic options. Ooh, oh my goodness. Jab lock with the down tilt to the up air. Try to get the backer out of it, but I believe he short hopped instead of full hopped, or he just flew a little bit too high. Up throw of Thunder, not really going to do it just yet. Panda definitely throwing out a lot of awkward options here. And Aloha picking and choosing his battles and actually able to get more out of it for it. Oop, Thunder Jolt. No jump. And you're gone. 38% here, only taking on Aloha. Very dominant first stock here. Down there trying to get the tech chase out, but Panda actually rolling into the stage. Air dodging away. There goes just the neutral B, just trying to get a B reverse out of it. 
Unfortunately, the timing is slightly stricter in this iteration of Smash. Only slightly. Ooh, trying to get a dash chance to a forward smash. Actually would have done it. Ooh, the down B not enough still. Look, there's the Nair. All you need. Three stocks. 79%. There's the back here. 98%. Oh, he might have gone a little bit too low. Trying to get the down B to just potentially take away his second jump here. But Panda definitely showing off a lot of... Of potentially panic options here, getting a little bit desperate to get these stocks, especially with that forward smash. They're just not really going to be doing it. Thunder Jolt dash attack, definitely a little bit of a combo starter here. Forward throw, no jump here in this situation. There's the forwarder, still not going to be enough. Forward tilt, yep, that'll do it. Definitely like character panda showing off a little bit of movement options, but I mean, I wouldn't really be doing that if I was down by two stocks on my final stock and winner side. A beat. Still able to make it. Forward tilt, not really going to do it. Up throw. Thunder? No. Back air? Not enough. Oop. Thunder Jolt taking away the second jump. Not going to do it just yet as there is Thunder Jolt and still throwing out the forward tilt option on whatever option he threw out. Hoisted by Aloha. Just keeping the pressure on. Taking it 2-0. 